Okay, going to check out Hobby Lobby first. Um, haven't had one ever near us, but it's uh, they did open up one that's maybe half an hour from our house, but I haven't been there yet. down there. I guess Master's Touch and Fine Touch might be the Hobby Lobby brand. Yeah, Master's Touch and they have their own paint too, it looks like. Academy. Might have to try one of their acrylics. See if I can find a coupon online as well for maybe 40% off. Just if you guys don't have like a magazine or something from the store, you can always check them out online and see if they have something available for when you're there. It's actually not a bad price for the brush cleaner. That's pretty good. Oh, that's good too. These are nice for like fine tip sort of applicators. I think I needed that. It's like an actual porcelain palette um, for $5.50. Not bad. If you get like 40% off to their store, that's a good deal. Oh. And I did need um, a sealer, actually, for doing acrylic paintings in a sketchbook. So I'll have to come back to that. If I end up buying some stuff, I'll show you guys later what I ended up getting. markers from that Master's Touch brand. through the whole 
place a little bit. Those are so cute. I actually have one like that already with like flowers on it. Oversized Michaels, basically. Oh, there's a whole fabric section. Wow. Floral section. Hobby Lobby now. This is like an independent art store. individual ones. She I can finally try point? them out. And then works with you? Yeah. Okay, I will remember that and mention that to her. I think that would be a lovely birthday gift. Okay. And with watercolor, there's some specific types of brushes that you right? Yes, you want a really soft brush as opposed to like oil or a little stiff. Yeah, because actually I I have no idea how to work watercolors because I've been using like my same brushes for like acrylic oil on them. And like, because I like when you do really fine lines and stuff, and so I use like a mini brush, and my teacher's like, what do you think of this super soft brush? And I'm like, I can't do anything with it. <laughs> so yeah, I need to learn how to use watercolors. Yeah. Yeah, watercolor brushes tend to hold more water, so they absorb it. Yeah. Kind of okay, that makes sense. Okay. There we go. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of funny. You, they're working in oils, but not have it ever had a watercolor class. <laughs> Yeah. Well, yeah. Well, water is completely different. Yeah. Yeah, but I had no idea. I mean, I really thought that you had done because I guess you did it, and so I just assumed that there was a staging to get to. It's a different beast, for yeah. sure. Yeah. All right, we are fifty-eight old three.
two more places to go. Here's Joanne, and actually, right there is Michael's. So we're gonna start with Joanne, and then make our way to Michael's. And that will conclude our little shopping spree, and then whatever I end up buying, or if I end up not buying, I'll let you guys know at the end. like all the end caps are kind of clearance clearance items so I'm gonna have to look through that more carefully <laughs> see if I can find some good deals on something um, ooh, a whole clearance aisle that's always fun oh where are these oh I guess that's all the planners from this year I have to get clearanced out some happy planner stickers cooking stuff. Oh, this might be convenient for um, still life. So, we'll see. That's nice. Another huge, huge store. There's a whole fabric section back there. I actually got my two Royal Talons sketchbooks at my local Joanne before. Ok, 
Okay, gonna check out the Michaels here. See if there are any major differences. Then I might go to TJ Maxx, but I'm not gonna make you guys suffer through that. <laughs> So this is the entrance and then the store starts immediately. So it's a different layout for sure from what I'm used to. Some washi tape, albums. This, this is the scrapbooking section. That's a canvas. Jeez, that's as tall as me. Hey makers, are you a Michaels Rewards member? If not, now's the perfect time to sign up. We're saying thank you to new members with this special offer. Earn $5 in rewards when you spend $25 or more. Don't wait. 
Sign up at Target. Hey guys, so I just wanted to make a quick little video to show what I ended up getting from the four stores that I visited. Hobby Lobby, I ended up not getting anything because I couldn't find a coupon online and they didn't have anything I liked on clearance. Um, then I went to Odd Nod, which was a really cute independent art store that had a lot of really cute stuff. Um, but I'm trying not to spend a ton of money, so I only got um, two things. I got a Blackwing... Um, this is like the balanced LUD, whatever it means, and it's like one of the special editions. So it's actually really cute. And I've never had a black wing, and they only sell them in boxes online, and I haven't wanted to get like a whole box. So this was a really nice way to try it. So that was really cute. So I ended up getting that, and then I just got this traveler's notebook just because I do need one, but like I need a refill, and I just wanted to support like a small bookshop then I went to Joanne and I did find a 40% off coupon and they had some of these uh, abstract sennelier acrylic paints and this like liquid little pouch which I thought was really interesting so I got the Titan buff which I do need more of and I really wanted to try this paint so I used the 40% coupon on that so I got that that was Joanne. And then at Michael's, their coupon wasn't great. It was like 20% off all regular price merchandise. And it's definitely more than 20% overpriced. <laughs> so, but I did find a couple of good things on clearance. So I found these acrylic inks on clearance for $10. Um, so I was excited to get that because I've been wanting to try them out. These are the Liquitex acrylic inks, and it's a three-piece set. And then also on clearance, I found this Golden High Flow set. It comes with three markers. Um, they have these different lines, like a thick one, a fine tip, and a medium tip. And you can refill them with this... Um, high flow paint or you can just use it as is and it has really nice colors um, a medium yellow a bright red a nice black a green gold which is a really pretty color and a fluorescent pink which is a really pretty color so you can just use them in your paintings or make a marker out of them so I thought that was really nice and this was on clearance for $20 so I went ahead and got that so that's pretty much um, all I ended up getting um, the stores that I visited but I'm pretty happy with it and my main thing was I just wanted to check them all out and see how similar or different they were and I was going to skip Michaels because I do have a Michaels near me but I'm really glad I went because um, these are both things I haven't tried yet and I've been really wanting to try so I was excited to get that so I hope that was a fun little you know video for you guys to watch to see what some of the stores might look like um, if you don't have access to them near you and just to see a couple of the things that I ended up getting. Thanks for watching. Bye!